Hello my dear students welcome back to my channel today in this video we are going to discuss class 10 important questions and this will be from chapter number 3 the gift of magi okay and these questions are taken from previous year board question papers and some of the questions are important which can be added in the upcoming examinations so i suggest you to watch the video till end and take the fullest benefits by preparing and discussing all the question answers to watch the video till end and hit the like button if you like it and share with your friends so that even they can take the benefit of this video and under this video we are going to see the questions under three different categories that will be one mark questions two mark questions and the three marks questions separately so that it's, it becomes more easier for you all to prepare so let's start with it so under one mark questions we have Question number one, what does the writer compare Della's hair to when it fell about her rippling? The answer is, the writer compared Della's hair to a cascade of brown waters. Okay, cascade is waterfall. So the writer compares Della's hair to a cascade of brown waters. Question number two, why did Della decide to sell her hair? Answer. Della decided to sell her hair to get a gift for Jim. Question number three. How much money did Della get for her hair? Answer. Della got $1.20 for her hair. Okay. So these are one mark questions. Let us move on to two mark questions from this chapter. And question number one. How did Della save her $1.87? Answer is, Della had saved her $1.87 by bargaining hard about prices with the grocer, the vegetable man, and the butcher. Question number two, who were the Magi? Answer, the Magi were the wise men who bought gifts to the newborn Jesus according to the Bible. The Magi were the three kings who traveled to Bethlehem somewhere from the east. Okay. Now let's see three marks questions from this chapter. Uh, we are going to see a reference to context type of questions. Even this comes under three mark questions. So question number one here is, it will grow out again. If you won't mind, will you? So you have to start like from which lesson it's taken and who has written and under what context the sentence was said. So answer is, this line is taken from the lesson, The Gift of Magi, written by O. Henry. This line is said by Della when she reveals to Jim that she had sold her hairs to get a gift for him. So when you read the chapter, you come to do the more detailed part of it, how Jim did not wanted her to sell her hairs because it was very beautiful and was precious. But she has revealed now that she had sold her hairs to get a gift for him. Okay, so this is how you write reference to context. Next question, will you buy my hair? So again, answer, this line is taken from the lesson, The Gift of Magi, written by O. Henry. This line was said by Della to Madame Sofrine when Della reads to Madame to sell her hair. Okay, so when Della was uh, very curious to sell her hair and get the money, she approached this Madame Sofrine who was a uh, by professional a uh, hairstylist and she asked her that will you buy my hair. Okay, let's move on to the next question. So this is a question answer that for three marks. How has the writer compared Della's hair to the Queen of Sheba's jewels and Jim's watch to King Solomon's treasures? Answer. The writer says that had the Queen of Sheba lived in the flat across the air shaft, Della would have let her hair hang out the window someday to dry just to depreciate Her Majesty's jewels and gifts. And the writer says that had King Solomon been the janitor with all his treasures piled up in the basement, Jim would have pulled out his watch every time he passed 
just to see him pluck at his beard with envy okay so there there are two sub questions added in one and so this is how you can write the answer so here there are these are the few questions which are likely to come in the examinations so we have discussed this i hope it was informative for you all if you liked it do hit the like button and share with your friends so that even they can take the benefit of this video and prepare best for the examinations and till then thank you